We noticed a couple of guys on an Instagram post started running and um, I said, oh, that's interesting, um, I might join them. A few more people joined and then it just sort of snowballed from there and then we thought, well, you know, there's a good 12 of us here, let's start a club. We saw the run for the kids coming up in March, a great event to get behind Royal Children's Hospital. So we thought no better cause, let's all get together and get behind the run for the kids campaign. Steve Monaghetti here, race director, run for the kids since inception in 2006. So it's been a, a marathon journey, you might say. To be able to give such great uh, support to the Good Friday appeal has been heartwarming, but also to see so many people return because they know it's a terrific event supporting such a great cause. We're going to have about 200 participants on the day joining the run club for the run. And there's a mixture of short course runners and walkers and a mixture of long course runners. It's going to be very, very big, very exciting. Rule number one is get to the finish line. Rule number two is to do it in an enjoyable way. So the short course is 4.6K, long course is 14.5 kilometres. But also this year, I'm participating, so having that extra aspect of a personal involvement in it makes it just that extra bit special. I've never had the perfect race preparation, but it is the best you can be, and when you get to the start line, it is what it is. I've met Steve Monaghetti before at a younger age. He was my idol and it was great to see him today again and the tips were really valuable to us. You've got this amount of energy in your body. If you sprint, you're gonna to use too much of it. The tips that I like to share about running is just keep doing it. Even when you don't feel like doing it, you'll get results out of it and it's, it's a great achievement. It never ceases to amaze me, the amount of emotion and families and the support that we get for this event. Two, three. Yeah.